Hi, I'm Laura Thompson, Extension Educator of Cropping Systems and Agriculture Technologies and Co-Coordinator of the Nebraska On-Farm Research Network. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you about how we've used 360 degree video to educate crop producers and advisors participating in Project Sense. First, a little bit about Project Sense. This is an on-farm research project. We have been working with 20 farmers each year to research and demonstrate a commercially available sensor system. This system uses crop canopy sensors to direct nitrogen fertilizer application during the growing season. The in-season and variable rate approaches have allowed us to reduce overall nitrogen application compared to what the farmers normally applied while maintaining crop yield. In order to demonstrate this technology, five field days are held each summer. During these field days, our Project Sense team has tried to demonstrate the technology to attendees. Ideally, we would be able to have the farmers experience riding in the sprayer to observe the system working as the nitrogen is being applied. Unfortunately, it's really difficult to do this since we don't know when we're going to be applying and it's hard to get everyone in the cab. I started hearing about virtual reality and 360 degree video and was really intrigued about the possibilities there for demonstrating the Project Sense technology. I purchased the Samsung VR gear headset, which allows you to experience the virtual reality and 360 degree video by putting your phone in. It was really neat to see a lot of the different videos that were produced and I thought this could be a really neat experience for attendees at our field days. So I began researching a little bit more how we could go about capturing some 360 degree video for ourselves. So let's go ahead and take a look at the 360 degree video that we produced. So as you look at the 360 degree video, you can turn your phone and see the different parts of the scene or you can drag it around. This allows you to really look at what's going on in the cab, check out the monitors um, and the different controllers in the system and look at what's going on in front of you. And it's responsive to the way that you move the phone. You can also take this and put it into the 360 gear headset, which allows you to really immerse yourself in the scene and experience it as though you were there. I wanted to share a little bit of how we created the video in case some of you are interested. To film the video, we used the Samsung 360 gear camera. Um, you can see it has two fisheye lenses and the controls on it. Um, you can control most things from the camera itself, but if you have a Samsung phone, it allows you to do even more control. The video stitching was done with software that comes with the 360 camera and then the rest of the video processing was done with Adobe Premiere Pro using metal plugins which allow you to work with the 360 degree video. We also added a narration to the video which directs viewers to look at different aspects in the cab um, as it explains what's going on there. Currently Facebook and YouTube are the only platforms that are able to host 360 degree videos. At the field days this year, we did not do any formal assessment of learner engagement. However, extension educators who use this technology at their local field days did observe that attendees who were able to view the 360 degree video prior to the formal program were able to more quickly grasp the concept of how the crop canopy sensors were working and were then able to ask some really good questions about details that they wanted to know and more information about the system. You can check out the 360 degree Project Sense video by using your smartphone or iPad and using your YouTube app and searching for Project Sense 360 VR. Thanks for watching and I look forward to seeing how others use 360 degree video and virtual reality to create unique immersive learner engagement experiences.